For me, what it does, worst of all, is it robs me of my self-esteem. And this is the part that nobody talks about, and this is the part that you think you're the only one. Last night, I tweeted, got to speak in Waterloo but before a great group tomorrow, and I'm really worried about when I wake up. Will I be me, or will I be the sick me, the replacement me? Because I can tell you that this today, giving two speeches, would be torture for me. All I would be thinking about is, why did I agree to do this? Oh, wh why am I here? This is so painful. I'm going to be terrible. I'm going to get up on that stage, and as you can see, I'm not talking from notes. I'm going to get up on that stage, and I'm going to draw a blank. So then I'll start to talk, and I'll be kind of panicked, and everyone will be looking at me thinking, wow, this guy's a disappointment. That's what it does to me. And that's what it does to most of us. Self-esteem is the first thing to go with depression. But you don't know it because your depression lies to you. Your depression will tell you stories in your head, and these stories will be so real that people, parents that adore their kids, would believe that their kids would be better off if they were dead. That is how depression lies to you, and that is how convincing it is. So depression lies to me by saying, you know what? You just got a big mouth. You know, you think you could talk about shit? You can't. You're going to be no good. Those people are going to think you're a joke. That's what lie depression tells me. And I think it's important to share that with you because everyone walks around with a kind of a cocky swagger. Maybe not so much as me, but most people, <laughs> most people will put up a wall and they will show you what they think you want to see as opposed to what they're feeling. And if you don't realize that, you think everybody else in the world is confident, but I'm the only one who's breaking inside. So it helps to know that this guy who is up here talking to us loses his belief in himself just like me. And that's something that people need to hear and people need to share.